Hello ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Exiled Kingdoms, brought to you by the Commander. So, if you are unaware, what you're staring at is a mobile game. Something new I get to do with my phone, I'm, I'm enjoying it a lot actually. I get to hear my voice, even though, you know, no one's around me. It's kind of, kind of nice, because it means no interruptions. But yes, I've decided to take it upon myself for the channel and bring something new to the table. Bring an Exiled Kingdoms to the game table. Yeah. Um, I, I've played a few days of it, and I mean, a few days, and, uh, yeah. I enjoyed it enough, I, I stuttered there for a moment, I enjoyed it enough that I actually bought the, the full access pass, I say that with air quotes here in the store, the full license, I mean. It's a great game, I enjoy it thoroughly, it's so far, you know, the most enjoyable RPG game out there that I've, I've played, and I, I enjoy every aspect of it. There are a few things I, I could see that need a little tweaking, but that's personal preference, so not like a huge thing that's needed. Um, you don't have to pay any money for this game if you don't want to at all. You don't have to buy the full license, but I would thoroughly advise that if you're looking at continuing this game, you do buy the full license. It's, it's a good price for what the game's offering so far. Um... As you can read here, it shows free license. There's 12 areas available, max levels 4, and you get 2 classes. But you buy the full license, it's kind of like a Steam Early Access game. You buy the full license, buy on the full game, and uh, you get it. You get everything in one package. So The game initially is free. You can go to App Store. I believe it's on Android. I'm not sh Well, I know it's on Android because it's where I downloaded it from. Uh, I'm not sure it's on Apple devices, so I don't know if it's on the... Uh, App Store. So, if it is, I'll have to look into that and come back to you guys. But, uh, it brings that really nice classic RPG feel. And, um, I'm, I'm going to start a new game because I, I've started two profiles here. One's on normal difficulty and one's on a casual difficulty. Uh, we'll look through it and exp I'll explain all the differences. But it's it's a pretty good game. I, I'm Again, I'm enjoying it a lot. So I'm going to override my cleric start. Because I really don't need a cleric. Um, it, it's kind of been interesting. I'm going to do a, I'm gonna do my own name. Do my own name first. Oh, nope. Oh, nope. Missing that, that one letter. Uh, one thing I'm very thankful for is they allow me to put in a last name. In many games that are RPGs, it's nice to have that that feel it's my character. So I, I want it to have a name. Alright, going to bring down the bar for typing. Uh, gender is pretty easy to figure out. Let's choose a portrait. Probably go with my, my casual one. Casual one, I mean... Cloak and Dagger there, or Cloak and Greatsword for this case. Uh, normally, with the uh, free license, you only get to choose between the Warrior class and the Rogue class, but by the full access pass, you get to access the Cleric. And they go in the great you know, descriptions, if you click the Learn More tab, it goes in the great description of uh, just exactly what each class does, and I think it does a great job at breaking down. So I'm going to do Warrior, it's, it's what I've I'm good at. Uh, let's move on here. So we've got four difficulties. Starting off, you only get you get the three first ones. So you get casual, normal, and hard. You don't get to take a choice from Iron Man, and I might be wrong on the hard, but um, you've got your casual. It's if you're just enjoying it for normal play. You've got regenerating life when idle and can quick save in dungeons. It's easy. Or you take the normal approach. The one that stabs you in the alleyway, kicks you and beats you down, takes all your gold, then comes back and does it again in a new spot the next day. Eh, that's that's a little rough, but it's it's practically how I felt. You know, every, every day. Every day in the game. 
It was run into a dungeon, get beat up at a few times in different spots, and come out victorious. And that was a great thing for me. I enjoyed that challenge. Um, I'm going to do normal because... <laughs> screw casual. Who wants to quick save in dungeons? Alrighty. Uh, you get four available points to start the game off. Each one is pretty descriptive. Some of them I'm not entirely sure. I would agree with. I mean, at first glance, it's kind of interesting. I see agility grants armor, and that's something I, I quickly realized. At first character, that I could not just blitz in here and, you know, make. Um, I do want endurance, because that affects my health, I believe. Yep, I was right. If you guys want to read those, go ahead and pause the video at any point and get an in-depth look. I think strength affects my damage. Yep. And I think I want awareness. Yes. No, wait. Personality. That I don't need. I can handle that later. Alrighty. We're going to move on. Choose your first skill. Now, there's some few hidden ones here that I'm not sure why I can't click on, but that's probably because I have to unlock them later in the game and whatnot. Uh, and it tells you here at the grayed out bar in the middle of my screen, bottom middle of my screen, what each one does. I'm going to choose, um, I, I think I want to go with my bash first, but I might take shield expert. Yeah, shield expert helps, especially later on for me. All right. I'll find my quick look and go ahead and start the game. For millennia. The continent of Andoria was united and prosperous under the banner of the Great Empire. Great pictures, artwork's amazing. Pretty good feel for it. Under the Emperor's rule, it looked as if the Empire would be eternal, forever strong in, it, in peace, flourishing in science and arts. But every Empire has to fall. Like every great nation. A century ago, the Deep Lords raised. No one knows who were these mighty sorcerers. But it's said that they came from another world. They opened magical gates, and through them, the horrors came. The horrors! Legends are not clear about what the horrors, I gotta I emphasize that, were or what they looked like. But in just a few weeks, the Empire was overrun, despite all its might. Only a few thousand survived, sailing away to the Isle of Varanar. Varan? No, yeah, I said that right. An Imperium colony. A savage and harsh land. Luckily, the horrors! didn't follow. The exiles endured the hardships, and to some extent tamed the land. But they built farms and castles, villages and cities, and finally, and finally, the exiled kingdoms were born into this, this world of darkness and hardship. I did a good job there, I feel. A century later, for many, the Empire and the Horrors are just fairy tales. As a young adventurer, you're more worried about your recent misadventures and your empty bag. I mean, I could do, be doing a little better had I not got mugged at the tavern. But your luck has changed. You received a magical letter from New Garand, somebody to collect a mysterious inheritance. This sounds promising. Money! Hopefully. You don't remember any relatives there, but oh well. Yeah, you started the journey anyways. While crossing the perilous Sagar Forest, you listened to disturbing noises ahead of you. Floating. Please wait. Alrighty, journal updated. Mysterious letter. Interact with the world. Remember what they taught you to never talk to strangers nor pick up things you find on the ground? Well, turns out in this game, you can and should. I love it. Alrighty, quick rundown on some stuff. I'm going to go ahead and save the game here. and Bam. Ooh, we got a chest over here. Bam. Great. Got a, I got an iron dagger. It's, a, it's okay. It's probably not as good. Nope, nope. I'm still going to take it, though. Sell it. Like all RPG games, I can sell it. Goblin. Oh. All right. Uh, combat. Simple. Just tap button. Got it. Stab. Just hacking away at a goblin. Mugged him, too. Oh, another one. Hack. Hack. Oh, he dropped some money, it sounds like. Oh, oh, no. He stabbed me. He stabbed me, I hack him. Makes no sense. It's like I'm just clacking him over the head with a sword. It's like, just die already. 
I'm, I'm looting him. What did he have? He had a goblin flesh cutter. Not, not good. Not, still not good. Ooh, I got 200 gold. Uh, shield. See that short that short his sword skill paid off. It it really did. Got to equip that. Alrighty, move on. Gray wolf. Ugh. Oh pelt, pelt. Good money, good money right there. Hacking, slashing, hacking, slashing. Oh. I don't trust you. Save. Alrighty. You're Adon. Adon? I, I think is how you say his name. Hello, friend. My name is Adon. I'm traveling this road going west. Are you headed that way, too? I make him sound like an older man. Um, let's go with the first option. Why do you ask? Thing is, I've scouted the road ahead, and there's a pack of goblets, accompanied by a wolf. That's strange. I'm not sure I can take them all by myself, to be honest. That sounds dangerous. We better fight them together. What kind of idiot just hires a stranger? I guess that'd be me. Let's quick save. Alright, hack and slash, hack and slash, and he's just over there strafing back and forth. Oh, click the button, heal health. Okay, let's do that. Quick save, as we get mugged by another goblin and just shank him. Ooh. Bracers. Let's clip that. Pretty good. Ooh, getting dark. Alright, I think this place is perfect to camp until tomorrow morning, don't you agree? No, oh, it's been enough for a day. But I'm not glad to have you along. I don't like you. Oh, this place looks good, but my map. But my maps. My bad. Let's say we should be close to a town called Lanagar. I don't know if that's Lanyager or Lanagar. I'm just going to call it Lanyager because it sounds better. Let's go to the town. Don't trust my map. What kind of fool are you? Well, got to go with the game, I guess. Let's not tell him about my inheritance. I prefer to keep my motives to myself, man. Well, of course you chuckle. I'll stab you in your sleep. Loading. Nope. Wait. There, I, I think I think he stabbed me and mugged me in my sleep. I think I lost. Yep. I, I was robbed in my sleep. Bastard. Welp. I'm dead. Let, let's quick save. Consult the map. Oh, I see town walls up there. Oh, and a little bit of perspective for everyone here. This is practically the world you get to unfold in. It, it's pretty good. It's pretty big. Title picture in the bottom here. 25 kilometers. Okay. Back to game. Let's go. It's not fair. I got mugged. Ooh, town guard. Welcome to the village of Lad, Jaeger Traveler. Here you will be safe from the goblins riding the road. Why doesn't the Baron get rid of them? Listen, kid, the Baron has more important things to worry about than a few goblins. Then why are you complaining? Okay, ah, uh, they become a problem, however, as they seem to grow bolder every day. Is there anything I can do to help? I need a job, and quickly. Always stuff to do, he grins at me. Okay. Ah, uh, yeah, you're nice and helpful. Obviously, I'm lying through my teeth, but let me grin back and uh, tell me what needs to be done, man. Uh, better be a good reward. I'm just saying, this is a dangerous job. I, I need that. I need that up front. Oh, don't make me laugh. I guess I'm a jester now. I, I guess I'm the town jester. You weapon seller, how much money? I got 18 gold, and I cannot buy shit from this guy. Okay. Ugh. So many people here. What do you want? Deren Jabru. 25 gold I can make? Nah, nah, I'm good. Nah, thanks, man. Nah, I, I'm not wasting my money on you. Guard chair. Hello, traveler. The government examines you in France. I would not walk north into Cigar Forest if I was you. Well, you're not me, so don't do it. Uh, have you seen someone called a Dion around here? No, I am sorry. I have not. I haven't met your friend. Not exactly my friend. Well, thanks anyways, I guess. Uh, so many things here. Who are you? Anna the Thirsty. 
25 gold? I'm good. Thanks, man. Thanks. Uh, who are you? Rodney. Rodney. Rodney! Greetings. 250 gold for bodyguard job? That's easy. Oh, uh, yeah. Where, where's the destination? It's probably very distant. I'm agreeing. It's 250 gold. Wow. Okay. I get robbed in my sleep and you assume I'm a newbie. Uh, well, that's, that's good to know. I don't want to talk to the man by the altar. Not man for religion. No. My past. It haunts me. Already, I guess, uh... I guess, welcome to Lan... Lanyager. With Captain Whitewater, the man who grins and apparently is, you know, easily humored. I want to say thank you, ladies and gentlemen, for joining me on my first quest here, and, uh... Let's continue. Ta! Ah, you thought that was the end of the video? Nah, I got five more minutes in this. Oh, wait, what'd that sign say? The notice says, To the abandoned mine, caution, goblins everywhere. Okay, quick save here. Ooh, goblin. Stab him. Oh, I'm not even gonna stab him, I'm just gonna just slice open his head. A journal updated. Where is that? Is that my inventory? It is in my journal. Goblin Hunt. The guard captain. In Len... Uh, wow, okay, I can't speak again. And Len Yeager has asked me to kill five goblins to obtain a new reward. Oh, to obtain a reward. I already killed one. Let's put, let's put this reputation. Oh. Quite a bit of reputations. I didn't look at this before. That is a lot. A lot. Skills. Oh, okay, that's pretty, pretty easy. Alrighty. Let's keep going. What's up here? Ooh. And take them on. I'm just gonna slice open their heads. Everything's gonna be okay. Yes, thank you for the quick save tip. Let's, let's rob this chest. Take 11 gold, guys. 11 gold. Stab. 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 If only it were stabbing, not just killing somebody. Uh, how close am I, anyways? 104 down. Wow. Makes me sound like a killer. Oh, wait, maybe I am. Alright, well, I should be done. Said five, so, uh, I'm just gonna head back here and handle this. <laughs> oh my god, the sniffing. Alright, get back here. You did it. I'm really surprised. Anyways, here it is. 25 gold and a potion. Yo. What's the new job? Hero. See... I'm already appreciated as a hero. I love this. So now I can trust you with a real job. A few days ago, to the abandoned mine. Sounds very dam dangerous, but I really need money and equipment. I'll do it, because I'm a mercenary for hire. That's who I am. Jeez, 80, H 80 XP, how much do I need? 300? Pretty good, I got a potion. Mm. Oh, I, I didn't know that's how it worked. Click, tap, okay. Exit. Jeez. Big character sheet. Let's quick save here. What does that potion do, anyways? 30 HP. Okay. I got 74 gold. What can I buy from you? Probably a better weapon? I'm okay, then, it looks like. Um, it's just... Go to the abandoned mine. I guess, according to the sign, it's north of here. Nope, there's two of them. There's two of them. I'm being, I'm being speared here. It hurts. It hurts so bad. Could you, sir? Could you stop, please, sir? Sir, sir. For gold. Let's heal up here and uh, head on in. I, I, I guess that's the right action, right? Alrighty. Alright. Oh, hello. Oh, aggro. 
There's a barrel. Oh, I can loot the barrel. Eight gold. Woot. Oh. Could, sir, could you... I, I'm just trying to stab you. It's okay. Another sword. Not a fan of it. Jeez. Took a while. Go for the chest. Alright, heal up. I saw I saw a marker. Oh, hold up. Oh, it, it's this. It's this. Have a little bit of an inter interesting box. Oh, hello, Taram. I'm here to save you. Help me. Um, do you know where the key is? Never seen a key. That's an issue. Alrighty. Uh, map. Okay. This will be interesting then. Path's blocked off that way. We'll go this way then. Oh. Th this this looks bad. Oh! I may be dead here. Okay, flee. Flee to safety. I can't quick save. I got plus three health from that and 60 fire resistance. I think it's at 60. Let me check here. No, 20. 20, my bad. It's a 20. Alrighty. Well, day one in the abandoned mines. Check. Survived. Check. Gotta go back in and save a poor man from his doomed fate? Not check. Alrighty. Is there some way I can get healthier? A bed? Something? Hello? What's in here? Castle. Nope, I have no fines to pay, and I don't need anything else from you. Nope, 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 bonfire, rest. 12 hours, 12 GP, why not? Okay. Can I buy anything from you yet? Nope, I will sell to you, though. I will buy a shield, because that's more important than anything to me right now. I, I have a dagger. I'm fine. <laughs> Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, this is where I say goodbye. For the first episode. Does well? Well, I don't care. I'll be happy. Mains, thanks for the support. But, guys, you should check out the game. And, if you like the video, make sure to click that thumbs up. Pretty sure I'm told that that's a good thing. And uh, leave a comment on your thoughts. I'm, I'm interested to hear what you guys have to say about the game so far. And... I hate asking, but I'm just saying it. If you want more, make sure to click that subscribe button if you genuinely like the content. So thank you, ladies and gentlemen, for joining me in Exiled Kingdoms today.